NASA postpones flying saucer test due to winds in Hawaii. NASA was forced to cancel six attempted launches of a saucer-shaped Mars landing test vehicle in early June because of unusually strong winds at the Hawaiian test site. Landing heavier spacecraft on Mars presents a challenge, as Mars's atmosphere is around 100 times thinner than Earth, meaning that it cannot provide sufficient resistance to slow down a spacecraft for a safe landing. To combat the problem, NASA has developed a low-density supersonic decelerator, a 3,048-kilogram flight vehicle which has the potential to overcome the obstacles of a Martian landing. The first step of the test requires launching the vehicle using a helium balloon, which will take the lander up to an altitude of 36,600 meters. The balloon will then detach from the craft, which will continue its ascent by igniting solid fuel engines. When the vehicle reaches 54,800 meters, it will be traveling at a maximum speed of Mark 4. As it slows down from Mark 4 to Mark 3.8, it will deploy a device called a supersonic inflatable aerodynamic decelerator, which looks like an inflatable hula hoop, to further reduce its speed from Mark 3.8 to Mark 2.5. A parachute will then be deployed to further reduce the flight vehicle's velocity on its journey back to Earth. The vehicle will then be recovered from the Pacific Ocean off Hawaii. The test is now rescheduled for late June.